Okay. Hi everyone. Happy Monday. I was just sitting down to create. Let me see if I'm live first. Where are we? There we are. I was just sitting down to create and I was using a technique and I've been asked about this in the past so I thought I would show you. It's a really super duper easy technique for spattering and it's not super messy but it looks really good. Hopefully you can see me. It's a bit dark in here today, isn't it? Um, I've left the house all blocked up because they've got planned burning in the area so it's been a bit smoky. Okay, for this technique, all you need is stamping blends. And you'll need the thick end. You can see that they come with two ends. So one's like a bullet point end and the other one's the brush end. And it's easy to tell the difference when you're creating because it, A, it's got the image, but it's also got the line. Okay, you have to be a little bit gentle with this because you don't want to ruin your nib. But all you need to do is take off the lid and keep it in your hand. Put your the nib in the corner and gently pull and you'll see that it starts to flick colour. And it's a really soft look. You can obviously apply it as heavy as you like. Can you see that? And some of your more juicy markers might come up with a with a, a more bold colour. But it works with any any of the colours. Let me choose another one. Let's try a, a melon mumbo. You can see this is a little bit more brighter it does go everywhere so just be mindful of what projects are around you I always have my um, pad underneath because as you can see it goes everywhere but it's just a really easy way to get a really pretty spatter um, but as I said just just go gently because you don't want to ruin the nib and just gently I'm just gently pulling down and it's flicking the color so that's my quick and easy technique for you today. I hope you'll give it a try. I hope you like it. And I will talk to you all later. Have a great day. Bye.